Hi guys, good morning. Uh, today I'm gonna show you how to make a splash screen with progress bar in Delphi XE7. In this form, I change the border style of this form to known. So now we don't have any control box at the top of this form and then i change the background of this form to I change the background color of this form to white and then i put three t image one two three because i already have this image yeah this is the first image this is the second image and this is the third image and then i put four label over here you can change the caption for each label over here then i put one timer and t progress bar over here okay i almost forget to tell you that for this line i use t panel and this text also use a panel i change the caption for this text over here and then i change the color to black and for another properties you need to make it like this okay uh, basically you can follow this step you can follow my method for adding all these uh, object to the form but if you want to make it simple basically you can design your uh, splash screen with the basic image yeah you can design it like this and then after after you finish designing the image I will show you you can start to make the splash screen I will show you how to do it let's create a new application yeah by default we will show uh, we will see the control box so I will change the water style to known yeah before i change the background color to white because uh, i want to i want to make it white but because we will gonna use the this image as the splash image i will directly add the image to the form Oh yeah, I almost forgot. We should change the position to the screen center. Then for another properties, window state is normal. If we run this, then it will gonna be like this, yeah. Okay, let's uh, change the image to to change the image like this, and then we can start to change the picture. Then load it, load 
the picture and add the add this image okay okay now the layout will be like this uh, we can change the properties of this image uh, we can change the property stretch to true yeah maybe we can make it smaller okay that's simple and press now it's time to add the timer okay this timer will trigger the progress bar to run so this property must be true and the interval 1000 is one second so we can reduce the interval to 100 and then let's start to add the progress bar Okay, we can change the position and resize it to like this then what you need to know uh, what you need to understand about this progress bar is the properties of max by default it's uh, 100 the minimum is 0 and the uh, step is 10 i will reduce it to 5 and we will gonna change the position when at the run time uh, okay let's start to code it uh, double click this timer or you can go from here Now it's time to make a code. We can copy the name of this progress bar and paste it. Okay, uh, now we have a condition. If the progress bar position is 100, then we will uh, do something over here. But if the progress bar is still zero or at the runtime, it will increasing by adding the position. Okay, let's start to run it. Yeah, now the progress bar running, but it will stop like this. So we need to add something over here. We will uh show sorry uh, i will add another form this form will be the main form okay uh Form 2 will be show and then sorry uh, we still stop the timer first show the form number
number two and then hide this hide this splash screen okay we will add the form 2 to the users list okay we can run it again okay now the, the main form is showing then the splash screen will be hide okay guys thank you for watching my video i think this i hope this short tutorial can help you learn on how to make a splash screen with delphi xe7 okay uh, don't forget to share and like my video and also don't forget to subscribe my channel Thanks for watching once again and see you bye.